Have you ever come out of the shower and wondered, hey, I want to rank some Roblox YouTubers? Well, here we go, baby, because that's what happened to me. And today we're going to be ranking some of the top Roblox YouTubers on the platform currently. So I don't want to waste your guys' time, so I'll get started. First, we have Ant Ant. We uh, we have Ant Antics here, and if you guys don't know, he's a pig YouTuber. Uh, he's talked a, bu a bunch about like the piggy like Netflix show or something coming up. I don't watch him too much, but I know he's pretty liked in the community, and he has a decent amount of followers. So I think I'm gonna put him in the amazing category because that, that's saying a lot for someone who I don't watch that much. Uh, I I think he's a pretty good YouTuber from what I have seen of him. And yeah, moving on, we got Ash we got Ashley the Unicorn and. She does blocks for content, like blocks for role play. She does like build, you know. She builds, she builds stuff. She like, um, what's it? Uh, how do I describe her? Yeah, she does role play. She builds stuff in blocks for. She like checks out blocks for like you know leaks and like builds and people have made and stuff. So basically, she's just an all around blocks for YouTuber. And I can expect that blocks is a pretty good game. So I think I'm gonna put her in the good category because it does get a little bit repetitive. But I mean that's all right. And then next we got Bandites. I'm pretty sure that's his name. Uh, he does Bed Wars, if I'm not mistaken, like Roblox Bed Wars, and I do really love the game Roblox Bed Wars, but I don't really watch him. I've watched like a handful of his videos though, so I'm gonna put him. I'm gonna put him in the not bad category because I don't know him too well. And here we got Burr. So Burr, if you guys don't know, uh, he's a he's a Roblox YouTuber that makes like the funny that makes like Roblox funny moment videos, and honestly, he's a really good YouTuber. So I think I'm gonna put him in one of my favorites. And this guy, unfortunately, I don't know who he is. It's Pirate. Uh, he's a Pirate. That's about it. I'm sorry, man. I don't know who you are, but that's right. Next, we got Connor3D. If you guys don't know, this guy, um, he does a bunch of, like, Roblox event videos on how to get free items. And honestly, I always watch those videos because I'm clueless when it comes to the events. So, I'm going to put him... Hmm... I'll put him in the good category, right now. I think he deserves to go there. Next, we got Dieter Play. He's a Roblox admin and a very good YouTuber. And he's also part of the Bloxy. Wait, no, what's it called? No, no, no I was going to say something else. No, sorry. He's part of the Canvas crew, which if you guys, if you guys, if you guys don't know, uh, Tim, basically Terabyte Games, Russo Plays, and then I think also Seniac and uh, Night Fox and everyone like that. They're, they have like a YouTuber group. Uh, the channel's called Infinite Cannabis, if you want to check him out. So, I think Dieter is a great YouTuber. I'm going to put him in... I'm going to put him in the amazing category. Next, we got Devin. I'm just kidding. It's not Devin. It's Devon. I guess that's how you pronounce it. Uh, he's... If you guys don't know Kaneko Kitten, he's basically like Kaneko Kitten. Um, he does, like, Roblox drama videos and stuff. And, uh, honestly, I don't watch him that much, but he's not a bad... He's not a bad YouTuber by, by far, so, I'm honestly... I'm going to put him in the good category. I think he deserves to go there. I'm sorry. I don't really know who this is. And FGTV. I have not seen anyone edit their videos as good as they have. I think they deserve to go, you know, in the favorites category. Plus, uh, you know, having, like, a group YouTube channel always, you know, benefits you. And, you know, it's always more fun to film. So, yeah. Next, we got Flamingo. Obviously, it's going in the e e the Elisa gaming category. Okay, next we got this guy, but I don't know. No, I'm just kidding, guys. Don't worry. Don't. I hope you guys don't click off in this short amount of time. But Flamingo is going in easy favorites, and yeah. Recently, I've been rewatching all of his like admin command trolling videos, and like those are those are honestly like great. I wasn't a big fan of Flamingo like two months like two years ago, but now like, nowadays I really like him, and I, I kind of I'm kind of sad I missed out on his on his prime time like admin command videos. So yeah, that's that's all right. I don't know who this guy is, unfortunately. And we got Gravy Catman. I don't really watch him. I've watched, like, a few of his videos. I think he does, like, just general Roblox content. I'm going to put him in the not bad category. And this guy, I'm sorry, I don't know him. And Hyper Place. Oh, boy, here's Hyper Place. This guy's my idol, dude. Like, I want to I be just like him when I grow up. And uh, he does blocks for role plays on his channel, which... I can also res I can respect that. Blocks for role plays are pretty fun. And he also, he also has a secondary channel. Well, he has, like, multiple secondary channels, uh, which do, like, IRL content, and, uh, one of them is kind of, like, dead, except for a new video he posted a few days ago, and another one, um, uh, it's kind of, like, a Mr. Beast-style channel, it's, I think it's just called Dylan, and the other one's called Hyper, or something, yeah, and, uh, they're pretty cool, I really like his in-real-life videos, his role plays are all honestly pretty good also, so I'm gonna put him in my favorite category, because this is still Hyper. I used to have my avatar address, if you guys didn't know, my Roblox avatar, those were the times. 
are I am Santa. I don't know her very well, but I do know her enough to know she does like uh, I think she what, what does she do? I think does she do role plays? I think she does role plays. I, I've seen a few of her videos. I've like they've been role plays or something. Like I I've seen those like, scrolling through YouTube. So I don't know that well, but I think she deserves to go in the good category. I think she did, I'm pretty sure she competed in RB Battle season two. So that's something. All right, I don't know who that is. Yo, Inquisitor Master. Basically, uh, these two, Inquisitor Master and It's Funny, uh, they're both big, you know, group channels with close to 10 million subs. They're pretty much, like, evenly matched, I'd say, in terms of, like, viewership and everything. Um, Inquisitor and Master, they have a group of seven people called The Squad, and I really like their videos. I think they're really well edited, so I'm gonna put them in the amazing category. But I don't think they can top It's Funny, to be honest. Despite the lack of, beside, like, the lack of, like, beside, uh, despite having less members than Inquisitor and Master's group, the crew, you know, with the K, I think, uh, I think they do an amazing job making videos and entertaining us, so. And I've known them for longer, so I'm gonna put them in my favorites category. I don't know this guy. I'm sorry. All right, here we go. Caden Fumble Bottom. I think is that how you say it? Caden Fumble Bottom. I think it's Fumble Bottom. Something like that. I don't know. But Caden Fumble Bottom. Um, he's good friends with Flamingo. I've I've watched a few of his videos, and he's also pretty cool too. I'm gonna put him in the amazing category because I don't know him that well, but I know him good enough, you know, to go in that category. Next we got Kaneko Kitten. I mentioned him earlier when I was talking about Devon, but I really like Kaneko Kitten. And, um, yeah, he does, like, Roblox commentary videos, like, about, like, drama and stuff. But he's way more chill about it than most of the other drama YouTubers nowadays. Which is why I think he's going in my favorite category. Plus, he has a nice voice to live, listen to, like, a commentary voice. Next, we got Create Crowd. That's an easy S. He live streams almost every day, and his videos are really, you know, his videos are really well edited. They're really thought out. He puts a lot of effort into them, and I really like him. This is one of his second channels. I don't, I... Th I don't know. Uh, is it just his Timmy channel? I don't know which channel this is because he has a handful of second channels, but I'm going to put it in the amazing category because I don't think anything can beat his main channel right now, obviously. Lanky Box, to be honest, um, they used to be cool, but I don't really find them that cool anymore. They don't, they, they've like seen, they're stealing Fuel's thumbnails and like their videos are like kind of fake and everything. And so I'm going to put them battery. Uh, what, which one do I put them in? I'm not going to go completely harsh, so I'll just put them in bad. But, yeah, they have fallen off. Let's just say that. Next, you got Laughability, another one of from another one of Flamingo's friends. And um, I know him less than Caden, so I think I'm going to put him in the good category. I think he does general Roblox content. like Or not general, like uh, the drama content, too, like Kaneko Kitchen and Devon. So I'll put him in the good category. I don't know who this guy is. I'm sorry. Next, we got uh, what's his name? May Rush Art. He plays a lot of simulators, and he's really good at all of them. So, and uh, he doesn't do commentary, but that's fine because I think his videos make up for that. Because they're all I really like his videos. They're nice to watch, and you know if you're bored, you can watch him. And so I'm gonna put him in the amazing category. Next, we got Megan plays. That's an easy amazing category. She does like adopt me content, and I you know I think it's really good. Plus, uh, she puts a lot of effort into her video, so I'll put her in the amazing category. And next we got Micro Guardian. If you guys don't know who he is, uh, base. If you guys know who Gamer Chat is, you you'll probably know him. Um, or if you know, or vice versa, if you know him, you'll know who Gamer Chat is. Who isn't on here though? But I mean, he he, he basically uh, Micro Guardian has a group of friends, like three friends, including uh, three friends, and he's the fourth friend. And they call them they call themselves the Fam, and they play Roblox together, and they have each have their separate channels. But occasionally you see them on each of their channels, and. I used to watch him all the time. I don't watch him much anymore, so I'm going to put him in the good category. But I really like his voice because he, he's really chill. He's a really chill guy, and I can appreciate that. And he's really cool. And his voice is like, I don't know, I like, I like his voice. Sorry, I don't know if that's weird. And this, next, we got Minitune. I'm going to put him in the good category because hear me out, guys. Hear me out. Minitune is an amazing developer. But as a YouTuber, I don't like, he, I don't think he's like, how do I say this? He's not a bad YouTuber. He just like he's not like YouTube isn't his main focus, which is why I'm not putting him in the amazing or favorite category. But like uh, what he does post on a YouTube channel is pretty interesting, and he has does live stream from time to time, so that's nice. Uh, anyway, we got some guys I don't really know here. Ugh, my username this. So there was a dra there was like a bunch of drama with him in the past, like like a handful of months ago when he didn't pay like his people who worked on his. On his best video, which was like a music video, which got taken down. 
And, and and people those people end up getting paid. And he said he was leaving the Roblox community though. Uh, but I think a, a month ago he he released like a song. I don't I don't think it's an already like pre made song, but he uploaded a song to a YouTube cha- to his YouTube channel to commemorate the Oof sound being gone. Um, yeah, and uh, honestly, I know he did some bad stuff, but I'm gonna put him in the not bad category because basing off what his content was, he did jailbreak content, and back in the day he was a pretty good YouTuber, and you know. Um, he just, just he just you know did a bunch of jailbreak content, which he still like does, but he doesn't upload that much. But I'll put him in the not bad because I feel a little bad for him, just a little bit. Next we got Night Fox. That's an easy, amazing category. I think it's the perfect place where he belongs because Night Fox. Uh, he does a little bunch of that similar X content. He's done uh, piggy content in the past also, and I really like Night Fox. I think he's a really cool guy. He participated in Mr. Beast Squid Game. Which, you know, I remember watching Creecraft's live stream, and Creecraft was, like, rooting for Night Fox all the way, dude. He was so ang- he was so angry when Night Fox, like, got out uh, in, the gla- in the Glass Bridge game. Like, Creek lost all eight of his marbles, or however the saying goes. goes. Next, we got Oblivious HD. Easy favorite. Easy favorite. This guy made the last guest series. He made Blocks Watch. Uh, he made, what else did he make? I don't even know what he made. Um, uh, he made the bacon hair. He made a bunch. He, he makes a bunch of amazing Roblox movies, and I cannot ask any more of him. He doesn't upload much, but I'm sure he's working on the on the bacon hair uh, part four. I'm pretty sure as we speak. Don't know who this guy is. Parlo. He's another Roblox uh, like drama YouTuber. I'm gonna put him in the good in the good category. I don't think anyone can really top Koneko. At least in my opinion, I really like Koneko Kitten. Next we got Peter Bread. He does blocks for content, like normally building stuff, but he does tours and occasionally plays other games. Sorry, by tours I mean blocks for build tours, and he also occasionally plays other games. And um, I like him more than actually the unicorn, so I'm gonna put him in the amazing category. Yeah, I really like his videos, and I, I like the funny voices he does and everything. All right, PG. How do I have this right? PGHL Films. They make a bunch of piggy movies. And um, the the movies are honestly really well made, so I think I'm gonna give them amazing for that. There's not much else to say. I don't know them too well, but they put a lot of effort into their like mini movies that they make, and I think that's really cool. Pink Leaf, uh, he's a Tower Hell YouTuber. He made a new like video called like like End of an Era or some, something like, like Era with the Era in the name. And um, basically, it was saying how like he's gonna like uh, like branch off from like from his usual Tower Hell content, and I'm really excited to see that. So I'm gonna put him in the amazing category. All right, Poke Digger One. What does he do? He does a bunch of, he does a bunch of uh, what's it? Blocks for not blocks for content. Sorry, Brookhaven content. He used to do blocks for content, which I personally do miss and like more than Brookhaven content. Uh, his Brookhaven, this Brookhaven, his Brookhaven videos aren't bad at all. I actually like personally enjoy them, but it does get a little repetitive over time and so I think I'm gonna put him in the amazing where back in the day if he if he still did his blocks for videos I would have put him I would have put him uh, in the in the favorites category definitely. Sorry I don't know who I don't know who these guys are. Is that who I, wait who is wait who is this? Who I don't know who this is guys I'm sorry. I don't know who any of these guys are. Alright, and we got Russo Plays. He plays a bunch of simulator games, and he's really cool. He's a great father. Yes, he has a family. He's a great guy in general. I really like him. He's going in the amazing category. And his favorite color is blue, which is also my favorite color. So, bonus points for you. Next, we got Shark Blocks. I actually really like Shark Blocks. I'm going to... Uh, sorry, sorry. I'm trying to scroll up right now. I'm going to put him in the amazing category. Or not amazing, favorite. Because, uh, honestly, I think he's on that level with Kaneko Kitten, where they, may, they both make really good Roblox news content. But he doesn't just make news. He also makes uh, like event uh, event style like videos with how to get like event items. So basically, he's a mix between Kaneko Kitten and um, where where is he? A uh, Connor 3D. And I really I uh, really enjoy his content. And I really um, yeah I just think his channel has a nice aesthetic, and his videos are really well made. So I'll put him in the favorite category. Uh, next we got Sketch. Easy favorite. He's like Flamingo, but just, you know, I don't know how to say it. Not as good. No offense, Sketch, but I do really enjoy Sketch's content. And, uh, yeah, that's basically all there is to say about him. Next we got Sub. Personally, I don't watch Sub, like, that much, but I think I'm going to put him in the in the good category. I think he basically does the same thing as, like, Sketch and Flamingo, basically with his content. I haven't checked his channel in a while, though, but, like, he's still a good YouTuber. 
And you know who could disrespect anyone who is part of the palace except for that one guy we don't we do not name. So next we got Tanger. Tanger does a lot of Bed Wars content, and I can really respect that. I, like I said earlier, I love the game Bed Wars, and I'm gonna put him in the amazing category because. Uh, I can't say this for every YouTuber nowadays. His video is actually genuinely fun for me to watch. And I like seeing him like beat everyone when he plays the game. Because Sanger is a pro at the game. Come on, man. You've seen his videos. You know what I'm talking about. Let's go. Terry Bar Games. These guys used to be in their prime back in the day when they played you know, Bubblegum Simulator. But too bad that game hasn't gotten updates in a while. They're stuck in Christmas. There's stuck, there's bubblegum simulator stuck in that Christmas update, even though it's freaking August, and it's not even August, it's September, it's September 2nd, the day I'm recording this, and, um, yeah, I really like these guys, though, their channel is great, I, li I like the two, like, I like their, you know, personality, so they clash together, I'm gonna put them, in, I'm gonna put them in the amazing category. Oh, snap, look what we got next, we got Thing Noodles, this Thing Noodles is an easy favorite, dude, I grew up watching Thing Noodles, Thing Noodles, if you guys didn't grow up watching him, you have no soul. I'm just kidding, guys, obviously. But I love Think Noodles, dude. He, he, he passed his prime, unfortunately, like a bunch of other YouTubers. But he's still a great guy. He's a great, you know, um, he's a great he's a great husband. He's a great, you know, everything. He's he's great. I love his channel icon, too. It's so colorful. And everything about him is great. And, you know, I love the guy. Next, we got Tofu. Tofu puts a bunch of work into his videos and editing skill, his editing skills or his editor's editing skills on point and... I gotta respect that, but he hasn't uploaded in a long time, which is kind of sad, to be honest. I loved his videos, and I still do, trust me, so, which is why I think he's going on the amazing category. He plays, like, Roblox Tycoons and Simulators and stuff, and sometimes general content, but yeah, I'm gonna put him on the amazing with Poke over there. Let's put him next to Poke. I know they're buddies. Next, we got Ved, wait, is it, crap, is it Ved Dev? Yeah, it is Ved Dev, all right. I don't personally know this guy too well, but I have watched a few of his videos in the past, and I'm going to put him in the good category, because I feel like I only know I'm good enough to put him in the good category, so I think that's a good spot for him, and let's see, don't, don't know, don't know any of these guys. Jeez, there's a lot of people here I don't know now. This guy, this guy looks so familiar, I don't know, he looks so familiar, he or she, I don't know who this is though, like I... The, their icon looks so familiar. I seriously don't remember who this is. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna put him in uh, and don't know them. I don't know. I don't know any of these people, dude. Ah, uh, here we go. Chase the Rooney. This guy makes more drama content, just like a bunch of other YouTubers on here. I'm gonna I'm gonna put him in the good category along with Parlo, cause they aren't as good as like I'd say. Um, they aren't as good as say you know people like Caden. Or you know, especially uh, Shark Blocks or Kanego Kitten here. And next, um, okay, I don't know who this is, but we have Lisa Gaming, and uh, yeah, there you go. Don't know who this guy is. Don't know who this guy is. Yeah, I seriously don't know who any of these guys is, or any of these guys are. This guy looks so familiar too. Just like this, this guy, just like just like this icon right here looks so familiar, but I don't know who he is, dude. He looks so familiar. This guy actually, you know, he's tap water and he also makes Bed Wars content. And his his videos are straight and short to the they're short and straight to the point. And I like watching them, so I'm gonna put him right next to Tanker. There we go. And I can say actually that's the last guy on here that I actually know and uh, watch. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video ranking at uh, all the Roblox YouTubers. Only a handful of favorites. Lots of really amazing guys. Handful of good guys. Um, a few not so bad guys. One bad guy and. A bunch of guys I don't really watch. No offense to any of these guys. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm so I'm sorry to them, but yeah. Anyway, and we got uh, one guy down here. He he's he's lucky I didn't put him down here too. You know, unless you got unless you can say I got someone in every category. Anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave that leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you do subscribe, make sure to turn on the notification bell to never miss a video when I upload. Be sure to join my Discord server, Roblox Group, and follow me on Twitter. And as always, see you guys next time. Bye!